This was the first day of early voting and the candidates in Port Arthur have been busy at the polls. Citizens in PA have four candidates to choose from this year. Some are familiar faces. Others are running for mayor for the first time. They're hoping to unseat the incumbent Thurman Barty. Troll News reporter Cameron Seibert met with all four of the candidates today. He joins us tonight with their plans for the city. Cam. Yeah, Jordan, there's certainly some challenges facing Port Arthur right now, but the one thing that all four candidates brought up today was infrastructure. Despite it being a rainy Monday in Port Arthur, all four candidates for mayor were out campaigning. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Matthews Christian Jr. is the new face on the ballot. Born and raised in Port Arthur, he recently retired after 28 years at Motiva. He thinks his work at the refinery can carry over. And I worked my way up through supervision, and uh, when I left there, I was in planning, development, and implementing. And there is where I plan outages for multi-million dollar equipment. This area flooded. It shouldn't have flooded. Willie Bay Lewis is also retired from refineries. He's making his fourth run for the job and spent the day at a new neighborhood in Port Arthur. You don't want to disturb him. Where drainage and infrastructure is his main focus. Infrastructure is high on their priority. The people are upset about the city service. They're not getting it. They're paying for city services, garbage pickup, trash pickup. They're not getting these things. Floyd Batiste is another new face on the ballot. His background is in workforce and economic development. I know how to bring people together. You know, I, 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 I know how to look at problems and solve problems and get things done. <laughs> Hey, What's up, baby? You all right? You all right, yeah. Oh, yeah. And the man in the chair since 2019, Thurman Barty. Also Port Arthur born and raised, his plan is to... It's like what it says right here. Continue the progress. So that our infrastructure, our budget, hey, our streets, everything that we're working on now at, at currently can be continued. Early voting runs now until May 3rd. It is time that we put the P back in Port Arthur, and that's the pride in the people. They should vote for me because I got the experience. I got 30 years experience in city government. I feel like I have the experience, the knowledge, and the relationship with business and industry. And the citizens have allowed me to be here since 19, and I know they want me to continue the progress, so that's why I would be the logical choice.